Hey guys, I hope everyone had a wonderful Easter. Uh, I had a bit of a break yesterday from making a video because uh, I was eating too many eggs. It's just, uh, yeah, I needed to do that. So anyway, today I'm going to be talking about uh, accountability and in particularly something that I found in a book that I read called The Hawthorne Effect. Now, The Hawthorne Effect basically is a study that was done back in the 1920s and 30s um, in America. And it basically says that your productivity goes up if you're being observed. OK, in, in a very, very short way. So in a sense, like the, the actual you know, definition of it is it the alteration of behavior by someone due to the awareness of being observed. Right. So the reason I want to talk about this is because every time you set out to do something in life, whether it be small, or big, whatever, isn't it funny how if you don't tell anyone what you're doing, you tend to not do it or you tend to procrastinate or you pretend to or, you, you know, something happens that means that you just don't get it done. Whereas on the opposite side, Let's say you, you know, you tell someone or someone comes to watch you or someone's overseeing you or someone kind of like keeps updating you or, or keeps sort of you know probing you about something, then you kind of get get it done quicker or easier or better. And and I, I think, well, the reason for this is because people feel like they have an accountability with that other person or that other thing. So a good example is um, I've got a fit band, right, for, you know, the, uh, the fit fit classes. I've got a band and I've always been good into, into workouts and stuff, but getting that band has made it so that I can now compete with other people on the app, right? Which is great. I love that sort of stuff. Very competitive, but it, it's made me work out harder because there's an accountability factor of other people seeing how hard I can work out. So like I'm not, it, I could have worked out just as hard on my own, but I didn't because there was nobody watching. Now I've got, you know, however many, 25 other people watching on the app. Like even though they can't see me, I know that they know I'm not doing what you know my best or in my head I'm thinking my best so it pushes me harder so that's you know one example of uh, of how the sort of Hawthorne effect works in day-to-day -day life so what I'm trying to say, what I'm trying to say is if you could challenge yourself right create a target and set out with intention to do that target every single time right you're more likely to do it than you are just to sort of go let's for example say if you're going for a run Right. Oh, I'm just going to have a run today. How far are you going to go? Oh, I don't know. Sort of do it half, half. I'll figure it out on the way. You're never going to do what you wanted to do because you, in your head, you, you haven't really committed to it. Whereas if you say, I'm going to run 10 kilometers, you'll get to seven. And instead of being like, oh, I'm done, you'll continue doing the extra three. OK, it's it's just the way the mind works. When you set intentions, you, you do the task. OK, the other way of doing it is by creating accountability. Now, the best way to create, create accountability is to tell someone, okay? And now what better way to tell someone by telling telling the world, tell Instagram, tell Facebook, tell whoever you're living with, tell somebody on Skype, on house party, tell someone what you're about to do. If it's, you know, a fitness challenge or like even one of these challenges that are going around, like a handstand challenge or drink this or whatever, like, or, you know, it's a business venture or you're reading a book or starting a new language, whatever it is, tell somebody about it because then you've got that accountability and that person if they're a good friend or a good person can keep tabs on you can be like hey how's that thing going you said you started and it just gives you that little nudge that little bump up them you know a little kick up the ass to get to get going right so in a nutshell if you have somebody watching in per se as the Hawthorne effect, effect says if you have somebody watching your performance and productivity will go up so Virtually get someone to watch you, right? Tell people about what you're doing. Tell people about, you know, the, your, your your tasks and your endeavors and your, your fitness challenges and all that sort of stuff because ultimately it's going to be much, much easier to do them when you know you've got somebody watching, okay? Hope you guys have a, rest, a great rest of your bank holiday weekend. I'll see you guys tomorrow.